Hello everybody, we're rolling along. Got another game here. Chiefs Raiders little AFC West matchup. The Chiefs uh, seem to have found their groove. Unfortunately, they found their groove at the same time as the rest of the division also found their groove. So they I don't think they have gained any ground here as they've, you know, improved their record closer to 500 as the Chargers have won out, I believe, up till now, and the Broncos have won out too, I think. Maybe they have lost one. The Raiders are obviously coming off that big tie last week. They're hoping to tie again. Be our first two tie team. I can't imagine there's I mean there had to have been a two tie team in NFL history, but like can't imagine it's happened too often, right? Kinda of look that up. I'm inspired. And up to a third and three. No team has ever had two ties in the same season. You bet. All right. Change the history today, folks. We're rooting for the tie. Oh, Chris Jones blows him up. Excellent coverage on the back end by Verrett. That's going to set up a punt from the Raiders. 0-0 zero, zero tie. Oh, since the adoption of overtime. Sorry, in 74. The 73 season had four teams with two ties. Sorry, I didn't I didn't get a complete answer from first Google. Give me that shit. Anyway, but so since in the overtime era, there has never been a team with two ties. Um, so we got to have it happen now. And Max Crosby destroys him, but Chubb Hover does break the tackle. He gets back to the 28-yard uh, line, so it turns a loss of five into a loss of two. And now third and five. And nice completion over the middle. Landry had a huge week last week. Uh, obviously, I mean, everybody had a huge week for the Chiefs against the Eagles. It was like, a very impressive showing for them. Uh, just continuing the momentum so far on this drive as they pick up another first down up to the 37-yard line. Jarvis Landry yet again. They go an outside zone. Better blocked, but just couldn't turn the corner. Anzalone gets the tackle. He's our league leader in solo tackles, I believe. Not quite overall tackles, but solo tackles he leads the way. Steps up. He's got Kelsey. Who makes the guy miss, but does step out at the 29. Third and two coming up. We go to the ground. And Anzalona gets the tackle, but he does get the first down. Nice run. He had a pedestrian week relative to his standards. Second and six, just on the edge of the red zone. We'll call it the red zone as he lined it up. Pressure comes, and he has to throw it away. So a third and six coming up. And they set up the screen. Nice block. He gets the first all the way down to a first and goal. I mean, Hubbard just took off. Shot like a cannon. Gets in the first. And now the Raiders are looking to I need some man coverage here. They go to the ground. Hubbard, nice cut. Gets a block. Down to the one. Put a foot in the dirt and get north-south. Couldn't have coached it any better than that. Pullback dive, 
and touchdown Chiefs. So they march down the field. Craig Reynolds is going to get them into the end zone, and we will see if the Raiders have an answer. Quick pass, but uh, nothing really there for him. Second and eight. Over the middle, he's got his man up to the 48-yard line. Good strike from Carr. Hollywood Brown the grab. As they threaten Chiefs territory for the first time today. We'll play action again. Carr setting up. And excellent catch right over Dante Jackson. Is that, uh, um, yeah, Wilson. Cedric Wilson gets another grab. He was a huge part of their win last week. I think he had over 100 yards plus the touchdown. Um, we're looking for another similar game from him. As uh, he's really stepped up and helped this offense. Uh, that was struggling for it. Uh, and broken up late. Going for Cedric Wilson in the end zone. Epps, who got a pick last week, breaks it up. And breaks the tackle down to the 25. Third and five coming up. And, oh, man, very dangerous throw. Could have been intercepted, but Epps just knocks it away. Raiders trying to settle for three now. Ooh, nice turn. Good cut. They closed down on him after the crossing the 30 yard line, but that was a nice uh, run there. And a completion past the 50. Chiefs are right back in business. And pressure of Crosby combines with Will McDonald for the sack. McDonald pushes him to Crosby. Crosby pushes him back into McDonald. Second and 19 coming up. Rolls out. Crosses body. He's got a man. Jarvis Landry up to the 32-yard line. His third catch of the day. But a, bit, but a busy three catches for sure. Oh, fourth catch. Shoot. Four for 80, so he has almost all of their total yards. Hubbard, nice job to get some yards on a basically a throwaway. Second and six. And second and ten after the pressure. Down, 
and completion down to the 12 yard line since of a third and three. Going toss, Crosby in the backfield, but he doesn't get there. Broken tackle down to the four, Hubbard. He's had some really good runs this uh, game, especially in the red zone. You know, he had that great cut last time. This time he avoids the pressure from Crosby and gets him a nice positive run. First and goal for the Chiefs. Let's see what they dial up. The run up the middle. Fumble recovered by the Raiders in the end zone. Just too careless of the football. And Hubbard, big mistake. Raiders get a huge goal line stop, and they take over at the 20-yard line. And on the outside, nice run. Get some seven from Zach Evans. And broken tackle, but he doesn't quite get around as Trent Irwin now down with an injury holding his leg. And the completion down to the 48-yard line. Marquise Brown, another 20-yard catch, it seems like. Going run, but nobody blocks Epps. Tackle for loss for him. Had a big presence on this game already. Going deep. Oh, and dropped by Cedric Wilson. He had a chance at it. Good ball, but just didn't get uh, filled in. Going out. And throws it away. So they end up stalling out at midfield. Going to have to punt. All right, so Chiefs get that stop. No harm, no foul on the turnover. Of course, they didn't get the points, but uh, still showing they believe in Hubbard, giving him the ball again, gets him the first down. Of course, they really don't have any other options, but. Flipping the play at the line now. Pressure comes, he throws it away. Holmes is just a tough guy to sack. He always find a way to flip the ball out of the uh, field of play. Crosby standing up just inside the bunch at the top of the screen. They go screen right at him, and they got it well blocked. Jarvis Landry up to the 43 as Deontay Hardy blocking for him goes down with the injury. Looks like Landry may have landed on him, so hopefully not anything serious. You're going toss, pressure at the middle again, but he gets outside of it. 
First down, Chiefs. Nice run from Hubbard. The Raiders are, I mean, they're covering this these tosses exactly how you need to. They're just not getting the ball carrier down. A rare miss from Mahomes on, on first and ten. No pressure or nothing, just uh, threw too hard, I guess. Rolls out and misses it just to nobody. A very dangerous throw from Mahomes that time. Uh, obviously trying to be aggressive, getting it to, I think, Landry there. But Landry is well covered, and he threw it so bad that, in a way, it was almost a punt. Third and ten, dropping back. Rolls out. McDonald has some pressure on him, and he cannot get it where he was intended. He was trying to go all the way down the field, but the pressure from McDonald to hit forces the... Uh, uh, failed conversion on third down. Now they punt, looking to pin them deep. And it's a decent one. To the 15 is where they will fair catch it. Carr set back on the field. Still down by just the four points. Deep shot. And again, broken up. This time going for Brown. Logan Ryan in coverage. Just left a little bit too behind him. He lays that out in front of him. I think they got six right there. Going outside. And Verrett does it. Or not Verrett, uh, Dante Jackson does an excellent job closing the gap quickly. Only a two-yard gain with a lot of space in front of him. And they don't pick up the corner blitz. Verrett just runs right by the running back. Sacked by the Chiefs. They force a punt out of their own end zone now. The punt is away. And the Chiefs will start over exactly where they left off. About the 43-yard line. Actually, no, I think they got to the 46 or something. So, not exactly, but close to exactly. Quick pass. They get it up to the 48-yard line. They go to the ground. Hubbard, he's got it. As he gets stood up at the 44-yard line. First and 10 Chiefs. Quick pass again, and uh, Hardy this time gets him down to the 34. Good to see him back in. And quick pass, he's got Hubbard. Gets him up inside the 30-yard line, first and 10 again. And a good catch from Hardy. Boxes his mile, gets him six yards. Approaching the red zone now at the 22 yard line. Wolf two in this area with the touchdown, but then obviously the fumble. We'll see if they can avoid the turnovers this time. Quick pass up to the 15. Kendrick Bourne the grab. And now an empty set. Kelsey at the top of the screen. Bourne at the bottom. Goes for Kelsey, wide open in the end zone. Touchdown, Chiefs. Just way too easy. A miscommunication on the back end. They felt like the corner was supposed to drop back into that, but uh, just was way too slow. Mahomes capitalizes. So with 2 2 to play, the Raiders will have three, potentially four, depending on it, if they take the kickoff back. Uh, timeouts to try to cut it back to one score. And they are going to return it. So a waste of the two minute warning and a waste of seven yards. Eight yards.
And a completion. Oh, he just barely didn't get up. Brown gets nine yards. And they hurry up to the line. They go quick out. Get the first. And get out of bounds. Nice job from Zach Evans to get him the first. Get out of bounds. Let's regroup. Huddle up. And a completion of the running back makes a guy miss. And he's all the way down to the 42-yard line. It's Titus Howard down with an injury. So a big hit to the offensive line. We'll see how they can hold up against this pass rush. But Zach Evans, two big grabs back-to-back, -back, both of them getting out of bounds. Uh, they go in the middle of the field, just you know, getting things moving a little more, I guess. Max Williams gets him a five-yard catch. Still up all three of the timeouts, so that is not necessarily the end of the world. Over the middle, wide open, Cedric Wilson down to the 12. So again, no, no real rush here. You can snap this about 30 seconds left if you wanted to if you're the Raiders. They are going to do that. So actually some clock management I would have agreed with. Now granted, they did go a bit further than I would, down to 20. But that's okay. Uh, still all three timeouts. Whole playbook open with 19 seconds left. Second and 10. And touchdown Raiders. Max Williams gets the touchdown uh, kind of the exact same way that Kelsey did. Just left alone in the end zone on a corner route. Um, different kind of coverage setup. Looks like a man got, might have gotten lost in the middle. Uh, but the Raiders answer the touchdown. Get it back to a four-point game heading into half. Um, can't remember who got the ball first. I think the, I think the Raiders did. So it's huge in that regard, too. They were down two scores with the Chiefs' chance to make it three. That would have been a pretty uh, difficult mountain to climb. But now, at the very least, you have a decent chance at uh, holding this down to the best two scores. And they go to the ground, but nowhere, nothing for them there. So they will take it to half. 14-10 to 10 lead for the Chiefs head into the half. Uh, been a decent half from Hubbard, but the fumble... Looming pretty large over this game with the deficit being how it is. Um, the Raiders, I think you just missed a couple opportunities, a uh, couple balls in the hands of receivers that just didn't come down with. Uh, if you get a couple of that, or that one big throw missed to Hollywood Brown deep. Uh, I think you get some of those to go your way, starting to have a different half. But this is going to be something entirely different. The Chiefs are in a foot race for a kick return touchdown. And he gets it. Deontay Hardy up the middle. No one could touch him. Chiefs start the second half off with a kick return touchdown. A play that I felt like they were close to last time they returned it. I think they returned out to the 30. Um, Raiders just barely collapsed down. This time they were unable to collapse down. And the Chiefs now open up an 11-point lead again. All right, well, now the Raiders are going to look to answer again. They go quick. You get them a six-yard completion first time. It's then Cedric Wilson down with an injury, so... Big shot taken on the slant. Hopefully he's okay. Not entirely sure who they had to step up. Renfro coming back next week will be big for him. Uh, like a quick pass, but terrible decision. Just got him lit up for no reason. Should have just handed it off. Third and four. And just a bad route concept. Leads to no room to work. 
So, going to see a punt. Pressure, McDonald gets the sack. He forced them into the first sack of the day, and now from the backside just didn't seem coming. Will McDonald having a big day against uh, um, Jonah Williams. And now Max Crosby's going to get a turn at him. But up the middle, McDonald gets the pressure, and a great coverage there from Woods on Kelsey. Knocks the ball free, third and 18. And rips it to the middle, but incomplete. Looking for Hardy, but uh, really the window wasn't there, and he overthrew it too. So 4th and 18, going to see a punt. Raiders seem to be going after it again. And it's a good punt over his head back to the 39. So they're going to you know, get the field position back a little bit. Going outside zone. And great job on the edge um, by, oh, well, he was cut, but whatever. There's Chris Jones with the tackle for loss. Not quite tackle for loss. Tackle for short gain. Third and nine. Pressure up the middle, and he tries to find Willie Gay, but Gay just knocks it down. So we are through two minutes, 20 seconds of game time. We've seen three punts and a, punt, and a kick return touchdown. Been a very busy two minutes, twenty seconds. Quick pass, they get it up to the twenty four. And Kelsey all alone, one man to beat. He does get brought down, but up to the thirty seven yard line. Just they're not covering him at all today. Hubbard, with no one around him, gets an easy first down pickup. Raiders just forgot about him. They get to Kelsey, who gets a yard, maybe. Second and nine. Rolls out, McDonald pressures him, and incomplete. Very good thing he didn't have the insane arm strength to get it that far. Because if he did, uh, well, let's just say, things would have gone bad. Third and nine. Pressure up the middle, and he can't get it to where he was intending. That's going to be a, I can't, I don't even try to say his name. He, he had two sacks against me, though, in the game that I lost to them. Uh, but... Settling for three for the Chiefs. Oh. 
All right, so not really the end of the world they couldn't score here, but I do think they would like to score, you know? And a nice ball, no one around, Marquise Brown, one man to beat, it's Epps, and he does get him tackled, a huge tackle from Epps, gets him now at the 24 yard line, Brown is definitely not an easy guy to catch in that situation, but a great path of the ball, a good pass from Derek Carr, uh, and I mean, just almost took off on him, first and 10 at the 24, play flip in the field, give him a chance to get a touchdown, cut it to a score, and, oh, he had him, but just didn't reach out for the ball. Didn't want to take the shot. And Evans gets him to the 16 for a third and two. So a first and goal now. Got the heavy set in. They go to the ground and great blocking up front. Especially the right guard. But Volson down with an injury. So not without its price this drive I guess. You go to the ground again. Power. And just didn't hit the hole fast enough. Tackle from the back side. Third and goal with a three. I think it's go for it territory. Get in the end zone you know. And Evans down with an injury now. So a fourth and goal. I still think you go for it. They don't. And a quick pass gets him a first down on first down. Deontay Hardy, busy day for the man. Yeah, that kicker turn touchdown. Got about five grabs, I want to say. We'll probably see it at the top here. Four grabs for 34 yards. Uh, and then again, this Hubbard out of the backfield is working really good for KC. They're just taking advantage of really soft coverage. And Kelsey off the uh, play action, working the opposite way up to 31. That's just such a tough play. You get the momentum going one way, you throw it back the other. Second and four. Field goal keeps it a two touchdown game. Touchdown makes it a three score game as they approach the end of the third quarter. Kelsey gets him another first down up to the 14.
and Jarvis Landry inside the 10 up to the 8 yard line. And touchdown Chiefs hovered, waltzes into the end zone untouched. Chiefs have opened up now a three score lead. Raiders are going to need some magic to happen uh, in the fourth to win it. So start of the fourth, Carr starting off with an incompletion and losing his other tackle, Charles Leno, down with an injury. Uh, it does look like Titus Howard is back, so at least that's nice. Second and ten. And dropped by Irwin, it looks like. Um, obviously took a big shot, but third and ten now. And they get it this time with room all the way up to the 44-yard line. Dax Milne with a grab. And up to the 50. And dumps it off. Brown cuts up field. Gets in the first down up to the 41. So they're trying to make it interesting. Touchdown gets it back to an 11 point game. Their defense is going to have to come up with some stops of course. That's a nice uh, kind of awkward slant from Brown. A little bit of a delayed action to it. Worked great. Changing up the uh, cadence of the offensive touch is always good. Second and five. And they get a completion of Mill on the inside. Mill's doing a nice job on these slants getting open. She dropped the first one, but since then, back-to-back -back grabs up to the 25. They go to the ground. Evans, great blocking in front, but unfortunately, he just takes too long to get north-south. Only gets six yards. And just a terrible idea. They're going to give Jones a sack on the play, even though it was definitely looking like a run play. For the nine, real last chance in the game sort of vibes, and thrown away, so that's a tough one. Now still down three scores, looking at Schwartz, but just threw it over his head. Um, didn't give him a chance to catch it. Hubbard on the ground, excellent blocking, so that's showing them how it's done. Up to 74 rushing yards on the day. Uh, if things go the way we expect on this drive, he may end up with uh, over 100. The 
And a bad cutback loses him too. Going outside, Hubbard. There's the great blocking all the way up to the 39-yard line, 91 yards rushing. And gets a couple up to 93 yards as we get down below four minutes to play in the game. And Crosby knocks him back. Third and 11. And they're in field goal range up to 35. They have to make it a three touchdown game. And they knock it through. So a very commanding lead for the Chiefs just needing to basically nurse the game and get on out of here. All right, well, down by 21. Going to go with unlikely. They're going to need to recover two onside kicks at this point. As Max Williams gets them up to the 26. Going deep. And doesn't get it there. Got hit as he threw. Third and four. And a great coverage, fourth and four coming up. They send the blitz, going deep, and he couldn't locate the ball after the tip. So, taking over right there, Kansas City. Again, just going to look to run the clock out. 2.42 remaining. This play likely could get us to the two-minute warning. Yep, it could. We'll see if they end up taking a snap. They shouldn't, but they might. And they do take a snap right at two minutes, so they flirted with the right thing to do, but decided not to. Third and six. And broken up. So, going to see a quick field goal. Raiders, another chance to score. All right, so car taking back over at the 21. Fail here. Likely just going to see the Chiefs kneel it out. And a nice ball. Brown another catch on the day. Up to the 45.
And a completion, another first down for the Raiders. And Milne gets him up to the 32, another first down. Fifty seconds left for the Raiders. Uh, probably a holding flag, gonna knock them back. They do have the first down as it stands. Second and fourteen now. And just nowhere with that one. Thrown to the no man's land. And end zone shot, or just short of the end zone. Milne gets it back shoulder up to the four yard line at first and goal. Raiders gonna have four shots in the end zone. Plus timeouts if they got tackled short. And broken up, Epps, another big play. Feels like he's been everywhere today. And touchdown to Schwartz, so the Raiders do put up another touchdown. And they pick up the two point conversion. Down by 16 now. And they recover it. Very aggressive recovery there. Uh, but he does get it at 37, so we'll like to see the Chiefs kneel it. Uh, they're going to run the ball. Sure, why not? 25 seconds left in the game. Raiders unlikely to call their timeouts. They do call. That's a little surprising to me. But they think they have a chance with 22 seconds left. And there's a nice run. That should do it for us. Hubbard, well over 100 yards now. 110 for them. Uh, as that is the end of the game. So a 37-21 victory. The Chiefs maintaining their momentum from last week. Uh, we'll see if they end up gaining any ground on at least the Broncos in the division. But nice turnaround for this team. They're back to the team we kind of we all expected. Uh, but we'll see you guys in the next game where I think, if I remember correctly, I'll look at my handy-dandy schedule that I have. Oh, no, it's not the next game. It's the game after the next game. We will Cardinals-Rams next, so I'll see you guys there.